A celebration in true African style. A fitting premiere for a movie that's set on the continent. Black Panther is Marvel's latest blockbuster, featuring an almost exclusively black cast. A superhero movie that tackles slavery, colonialism, and racism. To the rest of the world. With one of Kenya's superstars in a lead role. Oscar-winning actress Lupita Nyong'o grew up here, so the hundreds of people who showed up to the screening were hoping to meet her. The closest they got were posters with her face on it. The movie itself, however, exceeded audience expectations, and Kenyans are now using it as a rallying point. As a country, at this moment in time, we, are, we can't say we are very united. But this is something that should bring all of us uh, together, given that Lupita is Kenyan, given that the, the film that she's starring in is an international uh, uh, thing. So it is something that all Kenyans can, uh, can gravitate around, okay? And it can, it can bring us together, yes. It's a celebration of who we are as a people, a vibrant, dynamic people. Um, it's a celebration of the arts, and the Kisumu County region is particularly awash with that sort of talent. So we're just excited that Lupita chose to bring it to Kenya, and that we got to premiere it, and this is the county in which she comes from, and it's the county where her father is the governor, Professor Anyang Nyong. She was all over the movie, so that's why the whole movie was amazing, because when the first part she appears, guys, the movie was like, oh... <laughs> and then I waited, and then I was in love, and then at the end they kissed. <laughs> you know, it touched me because it had the cultural part of it, and then the technology, so it's old versus new. This fictional tale of Wakanda has proven to us that if Africa was not colonized, we would be acres and eons and eons ahead. Because we could recognize costumes, we could recognize accents, we could recognize all that is beautiful and amazing about Africa. Um, we could see some of our Maasai outfits in the movie. I mean, it was beautiful. We could see some traditional African skin cloths and all of that. So I think what happened here was we got to see what we look like when we're just amazing. Ahead of the official release later this week, Black Panther is already breaking records in Kenya as well. According to IMAX, some pre-screening shows in the capital Nairobi are sold out, something that's never happened in the country before, as fans show up to support one of their own. Valdi Karlsson, CGTN, Kisumu, Kenya.